We've got the Angels and Royals and the Stars came to play in this one and this was a high scoring game as Brandon Drury, this is one of the pieces that has really filled in the gaps for the Angels, just giving them depth. So that was a big signing this offseason. He's hitting not one, but two homers before most of the action even got underway. So Brandon Drury, a two homer game in the middle of this lineup is huge if the Angels want to have lots of success and the Angels have been very hot coming into this game winning 10 of their last 12. And with this Shohei Otani homer, it does a lot of things but one of them is give them a six run eight two lead in the top of the seventh so it feels like they were close to putting it away and winning this game Shohei Otani as a pitcher hits his 23rd homer of the year which is now good for the lead in all of Major League Baseball not just the American League and it's also his 150th long ball of his career which is the fourth fewest games played to reach 150 homers and 75 stolen bases with the three guys listed down below so very elite company for Shohei but then the Royals they had a little comeback of their own they were down 8-2 there's been some games where they've been able to put up some runs their pitching isn't quite there statistically they're the worst team in baseball but we'll see if they can turn some stuff around with some of these young guys including Bobby Witt who has star potential he hits a two-run single earlier and now he's going to hit another two-run single to tie this game up so after falling down 8-2 they tie things up at eight apiece but then who better to have up than Mike Trout as he's going to tie the game with a single he's actually been cold but he could be snapping out of it. He had two big hits today. He was crushing the ball today. So the Angels would take a nine to eight lead. And now even though they blew that six run game, they take the lead back. It looks like they're going to be able to win it, except for it's going to be Michael Garcia with zero outs in the bottom of the ninth time the game against Davinsky for the Angels. So they give the lead right back again. And then a little, little later, a few batters later, it's going to be Samad Taylor. This is actually his first big league hit and it's going to be a walk off. So despite Shohei hitting his 150th career, homer just an implosion for the angels this is a game that you do not want to lose in the top of the seventh you're up eight two up six runs against the team with the worst record in baseball bobby witt he hit four ribbies in the way to come back then michael garcia and samad taylor in the ninth inning coming up huge the royals are going to win this one a tough loss for the angels